Hey, what's going on guys? This is Trev here, and I am bringing you another modding tutorial for Minecraft Xbox 360. And today I'm going to be showing you how to do more potion mods. And right now I have, uh, Haste 4 on. And I'm not, and now I have Swiftness 4 on, which is higher and a lot faster than you can normally get. And now you can also get Nausea. And those, there's a few more, but these are some of the cooler ones. And yeah, Nausea gives you like another portal effect. And they also will last forever. Um, but I can't actually make a download because you just edit your character. So anyway, first you just want to get your save onto your USB drive. And then open up Horizon. And plug in your USB drive. Then go into Minecraft. Or well, games, then Minecraft. And then go find your save file. Go on to Contents and then find the save game dot dat and go extract it to your desktop and now I'm going to show you how to download the minecraft decompressor and I'll have a download or a link to this page right here and the link to horizon but you also will have to have winwar 7 zip installed um, I'm not I'm assuming you'll have that but if you don't then you'll have to figure it out yourself but um, you want to just drag that to your desktop I've already done it so I won't do that for now so it'll just have a little folder like that and now you wanna um, you want to click your start button and you wanna search command and then click on command prompt and you wanna drag in your a save game file into the folder just to make things a little bit easier and then drag in the minecraft decompressor file um, but if you can't drag stuff in on your computer I'll just show you another quick way uh, you could just do that but if you can't do that I'm going to show you an alternative to drag all these things in so you want to shift right click and then select copy path and then paste it into the command prompt and now you want to hit space negative D and then hit space again and then you can drag or copy in the save and then hit space one more time and drag it in again now use the arrow keys to go one to the left and type in M after the dat then just hit enter and now you want to open hex editor which I'll have a download in the description of course and you want to go click on the little well if you can't drag stuff you can just hit the folder to go open and now you want to hit the little binoculars and you want to search effects have texturing on have it exactly like I did there and now you can edit your data so I'm just gonna enlarge this for a second so you guys can see all the stuff to type it's a little instructions that I made myself and so for the first one you want to find the first dot after um, amplifier and you want to see the little digits that uh, correspond to that and you want to go right before it and you want to type 03 for the you could also go higher than that you could type in 06 or 05 or actually up to 99 but uh, I tried a, I tried doing that once and it crashed so I wouldn't recommend it but I think it might be possible and now if you want to edit the ID then you want to find the first dot I didn't I should have typed that and after where it says ID and here are all the different ones you can use night vision doesn't work by the way I tested it but all the other ones should. And in my other video, I already showed Jump Boost. But now I'm showing you all the other ones. And you want to type in whatever letter uh, or number. But f for this one, I'll use Haste for an example. But you could do whatever you want. And now you want to go in Duration and skip one dot. Not the first one, the one after the first one and you want to type in FF if you want it to last forever which you should want it or else it'll run out because you you can't actually make the potions you can just edit yours 
and then you just want to hit file save and open back up command prompt and then drag in the minecraft decompressor hit space negative c and then drag in the save game dot dat m and then hit space and drag in the save game dot dat now hit enter now you just want to open up horizon and go back to your save game file there and then go on to replace and you want to find your minecraft decompressor file folder and you want to replace it with the save game dot dat now hit save rehash and resign and you will be all modded and i'll show you getting back on the xbox so just make sure you're on your memory unit or you could move it onto your hard drive you just go into storage and system settings and then i'll just load the game up oh i forgot to cut out the loading time which i usually do but yeah and for haste it's kind of cool it makes your arms go super fast and the effect will never run out even though it looks like it's about to run out there but once it gets to zero it won't actually go away so you guys can try that out uh, to prove it but anyway I hope you guys liked this video and if you did make sure to hit the like button because the next video will be up immediately when I get 60 likes and that one's pretty cool and then there's another one after that that'll be it's probably the coolest mod I've ever seen but I just need to figure out everything first but anyway, uh, make sure you subscribe also, and make sure to show your friends and stuff, and I'm Trev, and I'm out.